in this simple tutorial i'm going to show you how to create this kind of animation in canva we are going to um, start from the beginning and i'm going to show you how you are you will be able to create this animation video using canva so let's dive into this video if you are new to this channel hit the subscribe button and turn off the notification bell so that you get notified anytime i drop another valuable video so on this channel i talk about video editing using CapCut. i talk about making design using pizza lab then i also talk about creating design using canva so that's what we do on this channel and how you can make money from the skill you are learning so to create this kind of animation using canva this is uh these are the steps you are going to follow so first when you open up your canva web page or if you are using the app when you open up you are going to see an interface like this what you are going to do is to click on video so we are going to click on video when you click on video you are going to click on this first option create blank so we are going to start from the blank document so click on that and you are going to go to another interface like this so you are going to see a blank documents like this so we are going to start creating our animation so before we start this is what you will need so go to elements when you go to elements you are going to search this we have two ways of getting background for your animation if you go to elements in the search button here you can search for let's say um you want any type of kind of background you want to use for your animation but for this i'm going to create um that roadside um type of background that you saw if you want to create a um, um, children playground you can search it inside here okay so let's start with this so um search for landscape I'm going to search for what you are what you need landscape background so you can see landscape background so if you search for this landscape background you can see different kind of landscape so for this you are not going to use photos we will be using the graphics um, element here so click on graphics when you click on graphics you are going to see different landscape here so you can see this landscape you are going to see different landscape remember some of this um, graphics you can use it if you are not using the canva pro app so um in the description of this video i will leave a video link that will guide you on how to get the canva pro so go and watch that video so that you can use some of these pro um, graphics all right okay so let's move on we have different um landscape images here so we are going to download one of these landscape image as the background for our what our animation i have this background that i want to use for my video so if you see this background it's not the same size as the um aspect ratio of design so what we are going to do is to enlarge this um is to enlarge it so after enlarging it what we will do because some background that you like that you might want to use for your um, animation won't be the same size for your aspect ratio so what you are going to do is to enlarge it keep it one side and click on the duplicate to duplicate this so we are going to duplicate it and shift it to the other side so if you can see we have the plant here so you can see we have a plant here we have plant here and the plant the one we duplicated is not the plant is not the same size so what we are going to do is to click on it then go over to flip and flip horizontal so when we flip horizontal you can see this plant will align it perfectly like this so if you should click outside you will see that they are aligned together okay so it looks like one single image all right so that's the next step so the next step is to bring in those other elements that will make our animation come to life so let's go over to the left hand side to add some elements so when you go to the left hand side you are going to search for um, car moving car so search for moving car so when you search for this moving car you are going to see other elements like this this is moving car so click on graphics the same process we use on getting the background all right so at the top here you can filter it okay if you click on the filter button you can um, look for animated moving car you can add animated and go over here so what you will see is animated cars that are moving okay so you can see animated cars that are moving so let's say i like this car you are going to click on this car and it's going to be added to your animation so scale it down like this 
putting it on the road it seems the color of this car you can change the color of the car from this place so that it's going to be different from the color of our streets okay so we have we can have something like this so we have changed the color of our car from this place all right so we have our car moving so we can make this car flip the car so that this car is going to move to the, to the right hand side to do that right click click on the car then go over here click on flip and flip horizontal so that the car will move to the right hand side so you can keep your car to the beginning of this side and animate this car we are going to i'm going to show you how to animate this car so that it starts moving to the right hand side but before that let's add another element that will make this scene come to life to do that we are going to add three to our scene so go over to the right hand side search for um, animated trees animated animated trees so we are going to search for animated trees so here you will see trees that are moving that have a little movement around it so you can add these trees to your scene so we are going to add this tree to the to this um, side of the road so we have a little movement with our trees just like this okay so we are going to add this tree so you can duplicate these trees add it like this all right so we have these trees on our scene so keep on duplicating and add these trees to our scene so you can see the tree now add a little life to our animation so you can group this tree go to position move it to the back of the car okay so you can move it backward to the car all right so we have this tree on our scene so we can add another car so that we have two cars on the road moving so let's search for another car we can search for moving car again so we can search for moving car and add two cars to our scene so this is what we are going to do okay guys so let's add another car so let's add this car so that we have two cars on our scene passing on the road so we have this car like this all right so the next thing we are going to do now is to i'm going to show you how to animate this car so to animate this car simply click on the car then click on animate at the top here you can see animate click on animate so the cool thing about uh, canva now is that it you can now create an animation using our own hand so let's shift our car first to the beginning of this um to the ending side of this route then click on the create animation so when you click on the create animation you can now see if you use your uh, finger or if you're using your computer use your mouse mouse to make this car go on a straight line hold shift on your keyboard then click and drag the car so you can see it is moving steady to the ending side of this screen then leave it so you can see the car moving just like this all right so to add a cool movement to this car you can simply go over here and click on smooth so that this car move smoothly without having any distortion okay so we are going to do the same thing to the second car okay so we are going to hold shift click the car and drag so that it moves to the other side of the screen so we have something like this the two cars are moving opposite direction so you can see they are crossing each other on the road so we have added our cars so now let's preview our video so you can see the cars moving crossing each other all right so this is how you add animation to um, your cars this is how you create animation video using uh, canvas so another thing you can add a new page at the dance side here so you can add a new page add a new page here create another scene then add animation between these two scenes so let me quickly show you that so let's um search for another background so let's search for okay so i since i like this background so let's use this background so just copy this background fitting here so just copy this background so we have this so in this other thing you can have um, um children walking to school or if you go here you can search for um, um a boy walking a boy so you can search for a boy walking or school boy walking so here we can look for animated um, stuff, animated human being walking. So go to um, graphics. So we can look for animated human being. All right. So you are going to search until you get what you are looking for. Okay. So if you don't have what you are looking for, you are going to search again. A boy, a boy walking. 
so you are going to search for what you are looking for all right so you can have a girl working you can also have a boy working so you can see this all right so let's add this guy so add this guy to our scene reduce the size so when you are adding someone to your um, scene you make sure that the size of the human being is um, is aligned to the size of the actual world so you cannot see a human being taller than a fence you look at this fence you can't see a human being taller than a fence so we reduce the size of the human being just like this so let's place this human being over to this side or okay let's flip this let's say this human being is walking from the right hand side and is going over to the left hand side all right so let's say this human being is here so go over to animate when you go to animate you can create animation click on create animation then go over to your scene just like this then hold shift so that this human being will not just walk and walk it will go on a straight path so this human being is going over to this place all right so you can see him walking so you can smoothen this animation and you have something like this okay all right so okay so between these two pages you can add transition between this stuff so let's add this transition or let's add this transition slide or this one okay or let's add flow so add flow to this all right so we have something like this so let's play our um, animation i'll see what we got so we can see so here after creating you can keep on creating pages telling your stories with this kind of animation okay so you add sound to your animation i'm not going to add sound to this animation because when i did add sound to some of my videos um it was copyrighted because the owners of those sound they claim copyright to the sound so i'm not going to add sound so what you, i'm going to explain to you what you can do so to add sound you can go to audio so go to audio here so in the audio search bar you can search for car honing so you can know you you imagine how the traffic is then you try to add the reality of uh, the normal life to their animation so let's say in in the traffic you can different cars will be honing so you search for cars honing and add the audio to your video so let's just do that um, car honing so let's search for car horn so let's play this Alright, so you can now drag that and add to your video. So let's see. So we are going to copy this again. Car horn. So we can add that again. So to car horn. So let's play our animation from the beginning. And you can see. Alright, so you can see the sun add life to your animation. So you can see the um, cars they are honing on the road and all that. So this is how you create animation using canva so you can download this and make use of it in your lesson if you are teaching people and all that okay guys so thank you this is the end of the video and i'll see you guys in my next video do not forget to hit the subscribe button and like this video leave a comment for me and let me see what you are able to come up with you can check in the description of this video you are going to see a link to my twitter page so share with me let me see your creation and i'll be happy to go through that so i'll see you guys in my next video